hi welcome to my channel today i'm going to show you how i made this face this is 100 percent cotton yarn in size 3 here size 3 and i use 3.5 millimeter crochet hook for this yarn okay and the other yarn is 100 percent acrylic yarn and this is size 4 to 5 here crochet hook and I use 4.0 crochet hook for this yarn you will see the difference between the two sizes of yarn in a hook and I also insert um, a gravel inside my weights so it will be more heavy for the flower you will need a scissor stitch marker so now let's move on for the tutorial for round one, do a magic ring. Wrap around your finger. Insert your hook. And make a chain. And do eight single crochet inside the ring. Once you have 8 single crochet inside the ring, pull the tail of the yarn and then for round 2, we will do a increase or 2 single crochet each of the chain for 16 stitches around. For round 3, do a single crochet in the first chain. So we will be working our stitches in a spiral, in a round spiral. And mark your first stitch, your first single crochet. And then in the next, you will do a increase or two single crochet. Repeat single crochet and increase in the next around for 24 stitches round four do a single crochet in the next two stitches or chain and then mark your first stitch and then single crochet in the next and then increase in the third stitch or chain repeat around for 32 stitches for round five do a single crochet in the next three stitches in one single crochet two single crochet in the third and increase in the next for 40 stitches around for round six do a this is the front loop and the back is on the back of the front loop do a back loop single crochet back loop only single crochet each and then mark our first stitch and repeat back loop only single crochet in each of the stitches or chain for 40 stitches around round 7 to 10 for round make a single crochet in the normal chain and single crochet each for 40 stitches around for round 11 do a single crochet in the next four stitches one single crochet two 
three and four and increase in the next repeat around for 48 stitches for round 12 single crochet each for 48 stitches for round 13 single crochet in the next five stitches one two three four five and then increase in the next repeat around for 56 stitches for round 14 to 17 four rounds do a single crochet each for 56 stitches around For round 18, do a single crochet in the first single crochet in the second, in the third, in the fourth, and in the fifth chain. One, two, three, four, five, and insert your hook in the front loop only, and insert your hook in the front loop only in the next chain. Yarn over, pull through two, and yarn over, pull through two, and repeat single crochet one, two. Three, four, and five, and decrease in the next. Repeat the run for forty eight stitches. For round 19, do a single crochet each of the chain for 48 stitches around. For round 20, do a single crochet in the next 4 stitches, 2, 3, and 4. And decrease in the next. Repeat the round for 40 stitches. For round 21 to 24, just single crochet each of the chain for 40 stitches around. For round 25, single crochet in the next 3 stitches. 1, 2, and 3 and decrease in the next repeat single crochet one two three and decrease in the next for 32 stitches around for round 26 single crochet in the next two stitches this is one single crochet two and decrease in the next Repeat the round for 24 stitches. For round 27, 28, and 29, 3 rounds, just single crochet each for 24 stitches. For round 30, do a single crochet in the next two stitches one and two 
and increase in the next or two single crochet. Repeat around for 32 stitches. For round 31, do a single crochet in the next three stitches. One. Single crochet two and three. And increase in the next. Repeat a run for 40 stitches. For round 32, the last round, do a single crochet each around for 40 stitches. Once done, um, cut the yarn and then pull up this yarn and take your darning needle. This is how I do my invisible um, stitch. Um, skip this stitch marker here. Skip one chain here and insert your darning needle in at the back of this second chain and skip the first one and then insert your darning needle darning needle in this back loop okay here on that back loop and then you will see it's look like an invisible stitch and then hide your tail inside here on the stitches and then here this one and then cut the yarn okay cut the yarn and then just um, pull a little bit and that's it fill with a little bit of fiber fill and then you can add your um, gravel and then voila you have your beautiful vase and thank you so much for watching if you have any question um, let me know in the comment and see you again next time